Alright everyone, welcome back to the channel, and today's video is going to be another Minecraft 1.16 snapshot. Now, this is a 20W12A, like I said in the Terraria video, which are going to come out on the same day. I made two videos a day, like I've been saying for the last past 45 years, okay? <laughs> it's been a while since I've actually made this. So we're going to go on to this first, and the first thing, which is the biggest thing, as you guys said, Crying Obsidian has a use now, yeah has a crafting recipe all right so we are here and uh, we're gonna go into this chest so crying a recipe or crying a uh, crying a recipe uh crying obsidian uh, and glowstone is actually so you're gonna need uh six crying obsidian and three glowstone you're also gonna need some extra glowstone on the side make sure you grab that now once we go here into the crafting table you want to do this do that and that and then we have the respawn Anchor. <laughs> Once we have the respawn anchor, you can just place it down everywhere. Place it down anywhere. You're going to need some glowstone to recharge it. So once we recharge it, it uh, does a pretty cool, pretty cool texture on it. It has the, the portal of the nether, and it has, uh, that's pretty much it. And this means that it is 1%. Um, it is actually half, it's, it's, it's charged once. So you're going to want to do this tw uh, twice. So here's the sound of it. There we go. That's the sound of it. It emits a lot of light. Sorry, I took some delays in there. Um, I had to turn down my thing so the uh, audio does not echo because I don't like when audio echoes. So that's the thing. So now what you're going to do is click on it and respawn point set. So once I do this, which it should work, bam, fell out of the world. <gasps> there we go. And then we used one one of those and you're probably going to want to keep some glowstone around it which i'll pick up my glowstone back up and recharge it back up now if we do this like more than like you you only have four tries so make sure you don't die in the nether or you're gonna have you're gonna, it's gonna be a bad time for you all right so let's just say that so once you guys make this i don't know crying over um obsidian do, does not have a recipe at the moment i'm pretty positive so uh, just make sure you do this like we can do this um, actually a lot of times uh, Show you that once you keep killing yourself uh, It's gonna keep going on and one one more time and I should there we go I Just died so many damn times. I lost my uh, lost the glowstone, which is over here So uh, let's go and see as you guys can see it's uh, pretty pretty bad. It's not it's not it's not not it's not charged anymore, so you're gonna need some more glowstone just to do that. Make sure you have a like a glowstone around it, by the way. You're gonna need a lot of glowstone. Glowstone has a use now, which is okay. I did I, glowstone never had had really good uh, of a use other than lighting up some stuff or uh, some other stuff that you guys used or some a thick potion if you guys didn't know that. But uh, yeah, so this is the um, spawning thing, and I think I like it. I probably will use it in the next update of 1.16. And I think it adds an addition to the um, game as well. So I didn't know this was actually going to be a thing. I didn't know they're going to say they're going to use crying obsidian in some way, and they found it out. And as you guys can see, the texture of the crying obsidian is around the bottom here. I think I like it. It's a pretty cool. It's pretty cool. So the next thing we have here has to do with the nether gold ore and some sponges. Sponges is with the hoe. So first of all. If we grab the bone meal and not throw it down on the ground, you guys can till or grow bone meal, this stuff right here. Just like regular grass, it's a small addition. Probably doesn't mean anything. I mean, if you guys want some extra plants to shear, I mean, I guess you can use it. Holy shit, and I just grew a mushroom. I did not know that. That's actually pretty... You can grow mushrooms. That's pretty cool. All right, I didn't know that. That's uh, something I didn't know. But you can till the ground and grow the big mushrooms to big little trees here. And if you want to do that, I guess you can. That's pretty cool. Did not know that, actually. That's uh, something new to me. And you guys can grab the plants if you guys want to uh, shear those or just grab them. I don't know what you want to do with the plants. It's up to whatever you want to do. 
So uh, the wooden pickaxe, uh, anything, I think it's below iron, um, you can mine this. So you need an iron pickaxe if you want to grab it, but I think stone and actually let's go ahead and grab a stone if you want to grab it we gotta go into survival again so we already we're already in survival oh my god he just <laughs> he just fell all right so he fell he's burning so if you want to do this you can uh but you're gonna get some uh golden nuggets which is okay i mean it's not you don't get a full um, the, the full one came from me, uh, grab, obviously putting it back. You don't get it full, and I'm pretty positive with stone pickaxe too. You just get, exactly, you just get the stuff. So anything below iron, you will not get it. But uh, wood's not bad. I mean, you just jump straight into the thing. You don't lose. And you can go ahead and craft your bars with this, which is not as much as bars as you would get if you use a iron pickaxe, which is... Something you should use. I mean, you should have diamond before you come into the nether, but the nether update, you guys are going to want to race to the nether. I know that. And, uh, yeah, the hoe is making its way up to be the most useful item in the world. Or in the game. <laughs> the world. Um, but, yeah, it's uh, very efficient. I said um, sufficient. Uh, it's very efficient. Okay. I don't remember what I said. Sufficient. I said sufficient in the uh, last episode. No, it's efi it's efficient. And uh, as you guys can see, you guys can, there's some right here. Just r randomly spawned in. So if you guys want to go ahead and mind that once the update comes out, you guys are welcome to. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I'm uh, having this thing pretty well. It's pretty well. It's awesome. So that's something. That's all I found in this uh, update today. Uh, besides growing the mushrooms, that's completely new to me. Completely new to me. And this right here is also new to me. It's pretty cool. I'm I'm actually loving this update so far. Uh, I hope you guys are excited for this to come out. If you guys are, it's going to be awesome. It's going to come out, uh, I don't know when, but um, there's uh, more uh, more snapshots to come. Probably in the middle. I would think uh, probably in the middle of the year because they said the there's going to be more updates this year. So, with that being said, also, there's not farms, fishing, AFK, <laughs> AFK uh, fishing farms are going to be, are not going to work no more, uh, they are taking those out apparently, I don't know what's the whole thing with them, but apparently your AFK uh, uh, fishing farms are not going to be able to work anymore, I, I don't think uh, even treasures are going to be able to, I, I don't know, it's something that has to do with the fishing system. You guys will see in the next update. I don't really honestly know about it. AFK, <laughs> AFK the fishing farms are not going to be working in the next update. So use them as to your advantage. It's uh, pretty bad, um, even though I never used AFK fishing farms. So with that being said, everybody, that is this snapshot, 20W12A. And I think it's pretty, pretty cool. I've... This is all I found so far. Not sure if there's anything new, new, but that's it, it's it's good. It's good. It adds an addition. You can go put this wherever you need to put it. Maybe by your portal when you die, or maybe put it in the stronghold or the stronghold. Maybe put it in the area where you need to. I'm not sure if this can this probably can work in the overworld. I'd imagine probably. Also, slash spawn point works, I think, in... Spawn, slash spawn point works now. I would probably cut, cut that out and just tell you guys, hey, slash spawn point works in the nether now. So, yeah, that's the video. That is the, it. That is everything in the snapshot. I'm pretty positive. And, uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And, as always, I'll see you guys... Uh, well, I hope you guys... I hope I see you guys in the next uh, video. And, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And, as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.